Hello YouTube, I'm back again. I just want to uh, thank everybody for not going out and acting a fool and burning down cities and acting stupid. You know, I'm, I'm just so proud of people that they didn't do all of that stuff. But then again, I started thinking uh, if the verdict would have been different, what would have happened? But I don't want to think about that. All I'm just going to say is thank you for not burning up the cities because this just don't make any sense. But I, I always been against violent riots, you know. Said it all the time and I'll keep saying it. But then again, I just wanted to make this video because I started to think what kind of world is my grandson and my daughters and stuff are going to inherit after I'm gone. I mean, it's it's a violent world. It's It's just terrible out here we had another shooting here in cleveland this one wasn't a, a police involved shooting but they did have one in columbus uh they shot a, they shot a 15 year old that had a knife that stabbed some people but i'm not gonna even worry about that i'm just gonna worry about what's going on in my little neck of the woods i mean it's just so violent i'm worried because i'm not gonna be around to protect them you know, in, in a few years, you know, maybe 10, 15, 20 years. I don't know how much longer that a person have to live. You know, I'm just saying. And I worry about my grandson and I worry about my daughters because, see, they don't know the things that I know. They haven't seen the things that I've seen. And, and, and they, they, they do things like I wouldn't do because they don't know how dangerous the world could be. I'm not afraid. See, I'm not afraid. Because I know what I could do. But I'm just saying, that it's so unhinged out here today that things are so violent that you got to watch your kids all the time. Women, especially, I got daughters and women are disappearing by, by the boatload. Every time you turn around, women are disappearing. We have a special reporter on our Channel 8, Cleveland CBS or whatever you want to call it, that, that all, they, all she do every morning is... Talk about missing women every day. Because she was a missing woman. woman. So I'm just saying, it's just crazy. Damn, your grandkids, they growing up in a world that I don't recognize, you know what I mean? Because they got so much and then so much is out there that can hurt them, you know. And it's just, I don't know, maybe I'm beating a dead horse, but I'm glad I'm prepared. I'm glad I got things put away. And if I never use them, that's great. They can always have them and use them down the line. That's why we prepare. We prepare for the future and the future is usually our kids you know our kids our grandkids our family members you know especially if you like me a senior citizen I, you know i hope i don't ever have to use any of the things i got i mean other than the regular stuff because we got snow here today and it's april 21st i mean i'm just saying other than storms and stuff like that i don't want to ever have to have food to survive on a nuclear explosion or anything like that so I basically it's not a gripe it's just that I was a little bit worried because you know it, they had the verdict and the George Floyd thing and I was just so proud that people didn't uh, do anything that's my son in the back my grandson in the back he's watching Rio uh, so that's about it thank you YouTube